Oh, Denise, ah, come on, come on, Denise. <laughs> Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Is everybody having fun? Yeah. yeah. I heard something that Mr. Mankiti said just a moment ago. Blessings from the rain. Is that? That's correct, right? Yeah, lots of blessings. So good afternoon. My name is Denise Jilson. I'm the executive director for the Harvard Square Business Association. And I'm so pleased to be here this afternoon on behalf of the city of Cambridge. Um, as you know, probably know that um, this weekend is the Democratic Convention. So all of our city leaders are in Worcester, hoping to change the leadership here, and um, they're, they're very busy. So on their behalf, I am so pleased to um, present to Mr. Mankiti a little proclamation. And it says, whereas the Grolier Poetry Bookshop is celebrating its 90th year as a legendary literal, cultural, and historical institution a beloved home to poets and to those who love poetry locally, nationally, internationally, and whereas in 2006, when the Grolier Poetry Bookshop was about to close, Ithiani Mankiti assumed ownership, preserving this legendary and historical bookshop, moving the mission forward, and whereas poetry, we believe, has a lot to offer if only readers can learn to tap its powers by allowing themselves an openness to receive the gifts of its miraculous hand, in Ifeani Mankiti's words. So therefore, preserving the Grolier as a magical place for poets and those who love poetry to gather was necessary and vital to Harvard Square, international, local, and international communities. And whereas, it was only due to the heroic sustained and tireless efforts of Ithiani Mankiti and his wife Carol that the bookshop was saved from closing in 2006. And through Ithiani's generous financial support that it now has reached 90 years. And whereas the Grolier Poetry Bookshop is now organized under the Grolier Poetry Foundation and Forums Trust along with the Grolier Press, which is set in motion plans for fundraising and events and publishing, publishing that will ensure that the Grolia moves into the next century and beyond. And whereas in this historic 90th year, the Grolia Poetry Bookshop has recommitted to expanding its mission of keeping poetry alive by offering new programs, building new collaborations with local, national, and international cultural institutions offering a wider range of intellectual events and activities and actively promoting the power of poetry as a unifying voice. Now therefore be it proclaimed that the Honorable Mayor of Cambridge formally declares this day to be the Grolier Poetry Bookshop Day in the city of Cambridge on the occasion of its 90th anniversary and in gratitude for the role that the Grolier Poetry Workshop plays in keeping poetry alive in Cambridge, and I will add, throughout the world. So congratulations, my friend. And I would like to add that on behalf of the staff and the board of directors, the president, and all the members of the Harvard Square Business Association, um, our congratulations. Um, we're a little bit older than you. We're celebrating our 108th year, and um, we, um, our mission is to promote commerce in Harvard Square while being good stewards of the outside space. So we hope you continue to enjoy this really, really um, lovely event and continue to get blessings from the rain. Thank you. Denise, and thanks to the SBA and to the city of Cambridge. Uh, we're flattered and really honored to 
accept and receive this award. Um, poetry, you know, means a lot to all of us, and that's why we're here. Uh, I think. Um,